Yeah, no, this is gonna take me higher up in the castle. I need to find that shrine. Um, let's draw some weapons here. This torch, this thing. I want to keep this. I just want to keep this for like a trip. You you could just like hang it up in the uh, at your house. You could. Here, let's go higher. Let's see if it takes us out even more outside. Because I feel like we're actually... Whoa. I feel like we're like almost there. Like halfway through the castle. But... Ooh, uh... No, I... Woof. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we're, we're good. We're good. Um, or you know what? You could have just climbed. I don't know what was wrong with you there. Where am I actually? Yeah, like, I think you're going to head out. Oh, there's like a... Yeah, that's like a bomb. Hold on. Yeah, look at that. Royal Guard Sword. Oh, that's cool. Or maybe the Hylian Shield is way farther up. Oh, that's gonna be a pain to find. Oops! Boom! Yeah, just keep driving it. Keep driving it. Yeah, we're good. We're good. I could wear the helm, but it would just look silly on me. Oh, this is like the big rim. This is like the big rim of the cat. Okay, uh. Where are they going? Oh, this is the, the, the dining hall. Oh, I can find the other cookbooks here. Jesus, Murphy. Oh, there's even more here. Yeah, I could I could actually find one of the cookbooks here. This is like a mess hall. God, I am so loving this place. If it I would love this place if it wasn't so fucking like destroyed by Ganon already. Wow, are they that clueless? Rivali's gale is now ready. <laughs> that explosion activated Rivali's Gales. Oh, care careful. Yeah, and there's like... There's like good food here that hasn't been eaten for like days. Maybe even years. Oh wait, he had a silver scale spear. What the hell? Um... Oh wait, I can just pick that up. Ha! This is the Royal Guard Spear. Nice. You know, I can actually just fill up the Hyrule Compendium with, uh... with Simon. From Pura's Lab, just by spending money. Okay, yeah, this is gonna take me out. This looks cool, actually. Like, the mess hall. There's a whole bird in here. Yep. This definitely does take through the medieval times. Lots and lots of mutton here. And even some shrooms. And the campfire! Okay, so... Do I have cane sugar? And tabantha wheat? Uh, no I don't. But I do know where to get them. What I need... To I should be going to find a shrine before I can get to... Before I can get back here. Oh yeah, I'm definitely, like, closer. I'm definitely closer to the castle. Or, no, this is the castle. You're just closer higher up. Whoa, whoa! 
Who's been throwing guardians up my way? You bastards. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Um... Yeah, no, I, I definitely need to find where the where the shrine is. So, how was I supposed to know this one? There's a hidden passageway behind one of these bookshelves. I I was looking at it for a split second. And I was like, is that a fucking elevator? I was like, no, they they can't have elevators in Hyrule. No, they they cannot have elevators in Hyrule. No, we're not in the future. But no, that it's a secret passageway to the docks in Hyrule. Jesus Christ. That's all I had to fucking do. Now I don't have any fires. Do you have do you have something that burns? Do you even have any fire arrows? Yes, you do. <laughs> You're gonna have to shoot it from right under you. Boom. There you go. Oh my god, how would... Again, this is one of those mo... This should make like a counter for like, how was I supposed to know moments? How was I supposed to know moments? Probably... Uh, Patrick's gonna expect me to do that, actually. Yeah, probably Patrick's probably gonna expect me to do something like that. But how was I supposed to know that there are secret passageways behind the bookshelves? And you had to use magnesis to move them. Again, like, there's a thing, like, I shouldn't be wasting time of, like, Trying everything with everything. But talking to people is okay, but like, doing everything with everything. I thought it was behind the waterfall. Oh wait, this is a... This is a fight. The last Guardian fight of all time. Let's go. Should be not too bad, unless... Okay, I... If it was a giant... Oh, I don't even have ancient arrows. Fuck. Hold on. Uh, and stasis. Ah, come on. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. All right. This is the last guardian fight for the shrines. Also, the special effects. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Come on. Got this music. Here. Hey. Hit it. Boom. Yeah. Boom. Man, I wonder what wonder what the prize is actually for uh getting all the shrines. Hold on, it's gonna spin. Yeah. Eh. Uh, whoop shit. Uh, I guess the boulder breaker. Whoops. Eh. <laughs> that broke too. Well, good luck with that. Getting so good at this. I just wonder how again it's going to go out. I'm actually... Okay. I'm actually going to be impressed. Or no. I, I don't know yet, but you will. You will once you get there. Yeah, look at that. Well, that's all of them. That's all the shrines. All the shrines cleared. But you still have, you still have to find that one more memory before you can get even further into the castle. And also, it's almost time to get some groceries. So maybe if we take a break, like an hour break, you can come back and be like, 
Welcome back. We're just gonna finish up the game. That's all you can do at this point. Um, we'll drop the hammer. Drop the mic. It almost looks like a microphone too. <laughs> Man, I wonder what he's gonna say now that I've cleared all the shrines. Yeah, I did it. Triumph over the test of strength, the birds, the prophecy of ruin, from the ashes of hero, a hero rises. Yeah. Oh wait, I skipped that. You have at last conquered all of your trials. Yeah. Having fulfilled our purpose, we monks bestow you upon this, the warrants of the true hero. You must now depart for the forgotten temple. Are you kidding me? I was just there. A gift from the monks. One of the shrines was actually there. Are you kidding me? I saved this one for last. Because it's at Hyrule Castle. I was about to finish the game. But now you're going to tell me to go over there? Oh wait, no, I can just teleport there. Duh. I could just I could just teleport there. Duh. But yeah. 120 shines, 100%. It's definitely not going to do the Korok seeds. Are you kidding? That's like a I don't know. I mean, you could. You could actually, but the result of it is hilarious. Oh, there are three. Let's see what's in here then. Cap of the Wild. Oh, I can get a tunic in this game. Nice. No more champion's tunic. Oh my god. They finally get a green tunic for this game. Oh my god, I am so wearing that. If I could... Yep. Oh yeah, look at that. It almost looks like the Zelda 2 costume. Oh my god, that's amazing. Now if only I could just upgrade it. It might even be... It might even be like the most powerful armor in the game. According to legend, this cap was crafted for a hero who travels the Windlands... Or the Wildlands... Wearing it just feels so right. Strangely enough, it's just your size. And strangely enough, they, they're they the most comfortable pair of pants you've ever worn. Ah, oh, that's amazing. I love it. That's fucking amazing. Hey, Rochelle, welcome back. I'm, I'm almost beating the game right now. I just completed all the shrines. I've gotten... I've gotten the Breath of the Wild's green tunic. Oh, and I also have to make that fruit cake. <laughs> I, I almost, I almost forgot about that. Actually, I need to make that fruit cake, but I still, I still also have to get some groceries. It appears they have sufficient power. You should not seek to increase this any further. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Yeah, even they say so. Myself. Okay, where's that royal recipe guy? And also I need to get some some of that food. I know where to get it actually, it's uh, the Rito village. I might be going on a break here pretty soon just to go get the food and then I'll come back and uh, or maybe the, the grocery store doesn't close until like 10. I could just hurry up and finish it. I could. But how long is that going to take? And also I have to do my laundry. Which I'll probably have to do tomorrow. I, I'll have plenty of time for that. <laughs> oh wow, it's Cass! Oh, he finally made it home! Oh, how are you doing, buddy? We meet again. 
I'm taking a moment's rest from my calling to enjoy some musical frivolity from with my daughters. These are your daughters? Holy crap, dude. Though it may not be within my power, I commit my wish as song that this piece might last forever. Mm. By the by, I have something to ask. I must ask of you. I need you to hear a song. If it pleases you, you could you come back here later after the sun is down? Ever so sorry for the trouble. Okay. I will. Yeah, go do what you gotta do. Oh, uh... Okay, uh, sentry. Hello. Boom. Wait, I could just... Hold on. Woof! Okay, never mind. That did... That did only the same damage. Boom! Good job. So yeah, you were walking down there. God, you must have so much in your inventory right now. Yeah, I've never actually been up here. Just don't lose track. Whoa, okay. Oh, this is Zelda's room? What the hell? Whoa. Excuse me? That just made him vanish. Whoa. Okay, uh... So I guess the ancient arrows are the light arrows now. This is Zelda's room, what the hell? Oh, this is a book. Zelda's diary. <laughs> yeah, let's read it. Let's read it. After meeting with the champions, I left to research the ancient technology, but nothing of note came to came of my research. The return of Ganon looms, a dark force taunting us from afar. I must learn all I can about the relics so we can stop him. If the fortune teller's prophecy is to be believed, there isn't much time left. Ah, uh, but turning over these thoughts in my head puts me ill at ease. I suppose I should turn in for the night. <laughs> P.S. Tomorrow, my father is assigning him as my appointed knight. I set out for Goron City today to make some adjustments to Varudania. I still recall feeling his eyes on me as I walked ahead. The feeling stayed with me so long, I grew anxious and weary. It's the same feeling I felt before in his company, and still not a word passes his lips. <laughs> still, still fucking aware that Link never speaks. I never know what he's thinking. It makes my imagination run wild, guessing at what he is thinking but will not say. <laughs> what does this boy chosen by the sword that seals the darkness think of me? Will I ever truly know? Then I suppose it's simple. A daughter of, of Hyrule's royal family, yet unable to use sealing magic. He must despise me. <laughs> I said something awful to him today. <laughs> what if these were like the memories that happened? My research was going nowhere, I was feeling depressed, and I had told him repeatedly not to accompany me. But he did anyway, as he always does, and so I yelled at him without restraint. He seemed confused by my anger, I, felt, I feel terribly guilty, and that guilt only makes me more agitated than I was before. <laughs> I am unsure how to put today's events into words. Words so often evade me lately, and now more than ever. He saved me. Without a thought for his own life, he protected me from the ruthless blades of the Yiga clan. This this is actually the events of all the memories I've been seeing. Though I've been cold though I've been cold to him all this time, taking my selfish and childish anger out on him at every turn. Still he was there for me. I won't ever forget. Tomorrow I shall apologize for all that has transpired between us. And then I will try talking to him to Link, it's worth a shot. Bit by bit, I've gotten Link to open up to me. Turns out he's quite a glutton. He can't resist a delicious meal. When I finally got around to asking why he's so quiet all the time, I could tell it was difficult for him to say, but he did. With so much at stake and so many eyes upon him, he feels it necessary to stay strong and to silently bear any burden. 
a feeling I know all too well for him, has caused him to stop outwardly expressing his thoughts and feelings. I always believe him to be simply a gifted person who had never faced a day of hardship. How wrong I was. Everyone has struggles that go unseen by the world. I was so absorbed with my own problems, I failed to see this. I wish to talk to him more, talk with him more, and to see what lies beneath those calm waters, to hear him speak freely and openly. And perhaps I, too, will be able to bear my soul to him and share the demons that have plagued me all these years. Father scolded me again today. He told me I'm, I, have, I am to have nothing more to do with researching ancient technology. He insisted that I focus instead on training that will help me awaken my sealing magic. I was so frustrated and ashamed, I could not speak. I've been training since I was a child, and yet... Mother passed a year before my training was to begin. In losing her, I, I lost not just a mother, but a teacher. Mother used to smile and tell me, Zelda, my love, all will be well in the end. You can do anything. But she was wrong. No matter how I try or how much time passes, the sealing power that is my birthright evades me. Tomorrow I journey with Link to the spring power, spring of power to train, but this too will end in failure. Such is my curse. I had a dream last night in a place consumed by darkness. A lone woman gazed at me, haloed by blinding light. I sensed she was not of this world. I don't know if she was a fairy or a goddess, but she was beautiful. Her lips spoke urgently, but her voice did not reach me. Would I have heard her in my power if my power was awoken? Or was my dream simply a manifestation of my fears? I am sure I will know the answer soon, whether I wish to or not. I turned 17 today. That means this is the day I finally be allowed to train at the Spring of Wisdom. When Link arrives, we will set out for Mount Laneru. The other champions will accompany us there. I have not seen my father since he last scolded me. Things are too strained now. I will meet him when I return. Actually, I've had a horrible feeling ever since that weird dream. No one would believe a failure of the princess, but right now, for no particular reason, I am filled with a strange and terrible certainty that something awful is about to happen. Ugh. And that's when Calamity Ganon happened. Yeah, this Zelda's this is Zelda's room, not Is that her bed? Oh my god, it's totally crushed. Jesus, uh Anything else up here or just this bow? Whoop, shit. Might be something new. The Royal Guard's bow. Cool. Oh, shit, I, uh, didn't mean to do that. I'll probably just get rid of you. Yeah. Anything else, or... T is this the changing room? Or is it just a treasure room? Like my precious 100 rupees. Whoa, what the... Oh, those are all pictures. Nice little desk, though. Okay, now let's not lose track here. I was I was strolling down here. I was I was walking along. No, that's that's still the docks. <laughs> what about there? What about there? Yeah. Excuse me. Oh, this is the king's study. What the hell? This is the king's room. Oh my god. Finding so many hidden secrets. The writings of Roam Bosphoramus Hyrule. Today as the sun rose and a new day was born, my daughter too joined this sweet world. In keeping with the traditions of the royal family, I decided to name her Zelda. I am not a man accustomed to frivolous musings, but now seems as a good time as any to begin my royal memorandum. Memorandum. Reports keep arriving regarding the evacuation or excavation of relics. The fortune teller's prediction seems to be coming true. Calamity Ganon was not a figure of fable or even a legend. He actually existed in our great land of Hyrule. We must investigate all the relics to learn as much as we can. But understanding the Divine Beast alone will take time. 
Zelda's eyes lit up like wildfire when I told her about the relics. I must admit, she has a knack for research. My queen has left this world. Her death was so sudden and unexpected. I awaken most nights unsure if she's really gone. Zelda never cried, never faltered. Not even during the royal funeral, or later when she and I were alone with our grief. I must assume her strength is a result of us repeatedly informing her of her duty to be a valiant and steady princess. For a child of merely six years of age, her conduct was truly that of a born leader. Her strength gives me hope. From now on, I must raise her all alone. Now I, only I remain to prepare her for her difficult future as Princess of Hyrule. Zelda finally reported back after her visit to the fountain. It seems her sacred sealing power has still yet to awaken. It has been a year and three months since her mother passed, and perhaps she is held back by heartache too deep to heal. If the Ganon prophecy wasn't looming over our heads, I would tell her to take her time, to wait until she's ready. But our situation is dire and leaves no room for weakness, even on behalf of my beloved daughter. My heart breaks for Zelda, but I must act as a king, not a father. I must order her to train relentlessly at the fountain. I was told Zelda went off to research ancient technology, so I had no choice but to confront her about it. She claims she was simply using her day off from training to indulge in a bit of research, but still I scolded her. She won't get it through her head, forcing me to tell her the same thing I have been repeating ad nauseam. The reason her sacred powers still won't awaken is because she is spending all her efforts playing at being a scholar. In truth, I understand Zelda's feelings, painfully so. She lost her mother, her teacher, before she could learn from her. Ten pointless years of self-training, without so much as a book or note to help her find her way. Those in the castle talk behind her back, and I, her only family, scold her for her shortcomings. No wonder she wishes to hide away in her beloved relic research. I'd love nothing more than to console her. But I must stay strong. I, she must fulfill her duty, just as we all must, even if she comes to despise me. I have been told by Zelda... I have been told my Zelda went to the Spring of Wisdom. This will likely be her last chance. If she is unable to awaken her power at Leneru, all hope is truly lost. If she comes back without success, then I shall speak kindly with her. Scolding is pointless now. I forced ten years of training on her, and after all that, it seems her power will stubbornly awaken some other way. Perhaps I should encourage her to keep researching her beloved relics. They may just lead her to answers I can't provide. For now, I sit anxiously. For more of a father than a king in this moment, I sit and await my daughter's return. Then that's when Calamity Ganon happened and killed him. Jesus! <laughs> Such sadness deep inside. I feel so bad. It has nothing to do with me. But... But still, that's so tragic. Okay, so then... I was here. Then I went past down here.